What's up, vloggers? Okay, Dum Dum, come back at you again. Well, I vlogs. Oh, that's all, that's all there is, I guess, isn't there? <laughs> I thought there was supposed to be more. Well, we got the mom stick back. Yeah, I, I forgot. So I thought... We're trying to get real into cussing a little bit. So every once in a while, you guys been watching. I just need to shut up and not say nothing. Because that stuff comes out of my mouth, it's a cuss word. Is that focused oh. on there? A little closer. So if you've been watching us for a while, um, that's our Instagram. So if you guys are on Instagram, go, go give us a follow on Instagram. I put on the story um, a uh, it's not called it's not a poll it's a question, isn't it? Is that what it is? Is it? I don't know. I guess it's a question. Yeah. So on this one, I did Q and A. Come and ask us anything. How many so, did you get? Anything? Anything? Um, I don't know how to do that math. I don't know. A bunch? No, I mean probably like sixty or seventy, something like that. I feel like that's a bunch. But, uh, so every once in a while I put that on the story, so just make sure you're following us on there. Check it out. Uh, what is that word? I don't know what that word means. I don't know what that word means. Okay, this is, uh, uh -huh. this one, this is Mike Cross. Uh, when you all gonna do a day in the life again? Just wondering. A day in the life of who? What, any of us? I'd say, well, I, I don't know. I guess. How long has it been? Like four, like three or four years? Well, like, I was honestly. still cleaning houses it's been for over three, three years. years. I was in, three years. I was in the truck. I was delivering. Unless you want us to do it. Unless you want us to uh, to do that. I mean, we can do that. He's asking to. He wants us to. Unless you want us to do it. He just said it. When are we going to do it again? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Doesn't <laughs> go, yeah. I don't even know what to say sometimes. Uh, this, was just, this one is for uh, from Josh Bennett. Uh, what is something we may not know about each of you? Something you may not know about each of us. Mm. Uh, my real name is Howard. Oh, you can't use that. You've said it before. I have? You got a, you got a piece of mail. I you have said it before? Yeah, that's why I said Howard Bell. Justin, I've never said that on camera before that my name, real name's Howard. Mm, I don't know about that. We and a question back. and answer thing? No, no, I don't know. I don't question that, but I know you've said somewhere in the past six years your name's Howard on one of the videos. Oh, well, my gosh. It's thousands. Okay. There's thousands of videos, and he said it one time. Yeah, I mean, I, whatever. Okay, so what else then, Justin? What else? Oh, oh my shoe size is 12. Yeah, you know, most of the time it's 12. Sometimes it's 12 and a half. That's something nobody knows about you? Oh, no. Yeah, the Brooks are 12 and a half. Nikes, it's normally 12. So What's something I, about you, Gunner? I have no idea. What's that? He wears like a six and a half. <laughs> I mean, everybody, nobody knows, cares about what size shoes he wear. I mean, you know, we've all been in a bathtub naked together. I mean, there ain't nothing they ain't seen. <laughs> I don't know anything. Trying to think something about. they might not know about us. Hmm. Well, I can't answer that one. I graduated high school in 2017. Yes. Yeah. There you go. What is a baby? <laughs> so, I'm, so you're 24? Are you turning 24? Are you turning 25? Can you just think about that for a minute? I'm turning 24, I think. What year were you born? You graduated I'm, seven. I'm 10 years younger than him. Well, then you should be turning 25. Or wait, yeah, I'm turning 35. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My gosh, I hope I'm 25. Are you turning 25? You're turning 25. What year were you born? 99. And 99? Oh, no, that's way off. That's way off. Yeah, there's no way. 99. How old are you? 2019. About 34. Honey, you're turning 25. Oh, wow. This year. 25. Yeah, I'm like, you graduated <laughs> 17. <laughs> I graduated. Garrett just, just told himself something about this. Something about oh, something he didn't wow. know. I saw something I want to think about. <laughs> I'm turning 40 this year. That's something I don't want to think about. <laughs> I graduated 2007 and Trey was in in the late 80s. 91. I graduated in 91. I was born in 84. The trade was graduating when I was five years old. What? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah I was five. like a year old, two years old. Or six years old. I don't know. I, was I can't think of anything old. else they would want to, that, that they wouldn't know about me. I mean, we've pretty much laid everything on the line. Seven years old. With us. Mm, with every, I know. I can't think of anything. Something, you know, that nobody would know. I mean, I don't, I don't really keep anything secret. This one is, this is, is for, I don't know how to say the name, Y-U-H-B-O-I-J-T. What's your favorite genre of TV shows or movies? Oh, I like comedies. 
whatever Breaking Bad is and Prison Break. He doesn't even watch TV. He isn't even seen any action and action and I like action, but I'd, I'd, I'd rather really see a comedy. I think comedies are. It has to be a good comedy. It can't be corny. If mm-hmm. it's gonna be a comedy, I'm probably what an What they're under. I like the series too. I like to watch the series like on Netflix and stuff like that. I watched uh, recently. I watched that Headhunter. Yeah, I haven't seen that. Not Headhunter. What is it called? Mind Mind Hunter. Mm-hmm. You was telling me about that. You, you need something. to. You haven't seen it. Uh-uh. You need to watch it. It's very good. What's I mean, it on Netflix? Yeah. Yeah. We're watching mm-hmm. that Animal Kingdom on Prime. I told Justin you guys need to watch that. That's there's a couple things in there I don't totally agree with, but. It's actually it's it's a pretty good series, but I like that stuff. But I but I you can't beat just like an old good old fashioned wedding crashers or you know the Hangover or something like that. It's just I think that's Step stuff's Brothers. Hilarious. I think is one Step of the Step Brothers. Funniest. I think that stuff's hilarious. You know, yeah, that'd probably be comedy for me in an action second. Yeah, I like to laugh. You know, so go Aaron ahead. doesn't want to me say. Um, he just said break it bad. What sports slash activities? Did you do in school slash growing up? This is from C. Do that one. Miller. Watch one. Oh. Who would be your dream guest star? He reads one and then he reads oh, another. Yeah, we got to finish this one first. What activities? Garen played soccer. What sports activities did he do in school growing up? Who sent it? What? C. M. I. Like- L. L. A. I. L. L. A. C. Miller. C. Miller. I played football and ran and played. What else did I do? Football and That's it. No, I played ran track, did the shot put track. Oh. And um ooh, rode dirt bikes, basically. That was about it. Through school. And I played soccer my junior and senior year and that's it. Uh, I did basketball, soccer, and football. All for how long each? Oh, he's, he's a, he's a, no, a no, five he's a minutes each. No, it was the intramurals. We all oh, played, I did soccer for a long time. We all played intramurals. Sports. I did soccer for a long time. How long? Oh, I don't you know. You physically played sp- soccer? Probably three or four years, yeah. yeah Wait, he, how old were you? No, this is all from this, sixth grade under. No, yeah. he said high school. The YMCA. He, he said high school. school. No, yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. What sports slash activities did you do in school growing up? Well, you wasn't in school when you were playing soccer. Yes, I was. Yeah. Sixth grade, younger. Yeah, I did. I stopped playing soccer in sixth grade. Oh my God! Well, if you go back, I did played basketball. I played baseball. All that stuff for. Oh man, no too. I, was I did all that. I was in the band for a long time. Three so years. So I'm saying, well, how long are we going back here? When I was in diapers? What well, he said? You're on up. Oh, I was in band too. I played the clarinet. <laughs> Playing on the basketball team in elementary school don't count. They let no, the that team. was the YMCA. I though. played for Taylor Mill Boosters. We played football, or we played baseball and basketball for Taylor Mill Boosters. <laughs> we did it. Says, uh, says, who would be the dream guest star to have in one of your videos? All right, everybody already knows Trace. What's yours, Trey? You don't, you don't know mine. Yeah, it's either Kid Rock or Trump. <laughs> it's only two options. That's it. He ain't got nobody else. No, that's not true. He might, he might, uh, might, Mark Wilberg might make the cut. Uh, I mean, like, like somebody to meet, like this. I don't know. It's, it's, I, I don't, I don't get starstruck. I don't, I mean, I don't. I've heard Kid Rock is a douchebag though. Like to meet him, like he's not a very friendly, Mark War- Wilberg. Yeah. He's supposed to be really cool if you meet him out, but supposedly Kid Rock is like super, I mean, I'm sure he gets bombarded every time he. Breathe, yeah, those people know? like people like that that can't even go out to you know you can't so you go to a Walmart, dinner. you can't do a Walmart, right. you can't do you can't do nothing because people are up your butt all the time. Right. Um, I, I mean, like to have on the show, like to do a video. <coughs> Gosh. Why don't you open it? It gains some pressure. Okay. That, that, was, that was drama. <laughs> Yeah, that stuff's awful. Man. Why'd you open the lid? I didn't know it'd be pressurized. I don't know why it's so, it's can't be good. <coughs> I don't know, Justin. Dream guest I'm, star to I'm, have in one of your videos. I'm going. Oh, I, I wanted him to say this. I, I want the Liver King to come here. I think that'd be the coolest thing. Liver ever. King? Yeah, he'd get all kinds of hate right now. Everything. He's, oh, he's, he's awesome. still over the steroid stuff. Yeah, or it's no? stupid. I don't he's understand been. why people are making. Because that's all they got to talk about, Garen. Same crap. I think he's cool. Who Does cares? he smell though? Everybody says he smells on oh, podcasts. I've never he's met him. I've never met him. No, I'm not even being funny. They say he stinks. I don't know if he does. I would like to eat how he eats. Ew, no, I would. Ew. That raw diet? No, no, no. Mm-hmm. I want some I'd chicken love, fingers. I would love to be able to try to do yeah. that. Nah. I want some nah. chicken fingers. I don't really have anybody that I like. I mean, that I would like. Oh, I want to meet. I mean, like having a video and talk to them. I mean, 
I would like. I would obviously like to meet Trump. You know, just to say, say super job. I would like to just to tell him that, but um, and I do like Kid Rock, but I like you know ACDC. I like Van Halen. I mean, there's a lot of people that I you know. I really like Motley Crue. I mean, you know, I like them a lot too. So, but to have them in a video, we like have the, to wheel them in here in wheelchairs. No, nah, they're all still kicking. They're all still good. Now nah, Eddie Van Halen died, and so did. Uh, not Agnes, but the other young. How player, do you think right? they got the name of Van Halen? Got a ten pack. They, you know who got the, you know who actually got them their start? Van Halen. Who? ACDC. Gene, Gene Simmons. Oh. Who's oh, that? Kiss. Kiss. Oh, Kiss, the tongue guy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> he does it. What? Uh, what? Who would you want, Justin? Um, he wants the Liver King. I, I would not even care if the Liver King walked down the street. I Why? Just, he doesn't. Do I think he's cool. Uh, whatever. I mean, he's all right. I mean, I just don't really. He doesn't. He doesn't do much for me. But whatever. <clears throat> um. I honestly don't know. I think that's a hard question because you I don't, don't know I don't, how you're gonna jive with somebody else. You know what I mean? And having them in a video or something—that's that's hard to do. I really if don't. They're a cocksucker, I, yeah. you know. Oh, I, I can name all kinds of people. Matt from Demolition Ranch. Roman Atwood. Roman Atwood would be the coolest person to show up here in the See, world. See, you're in a younger generation. That's totally younger. I think generation. he's awesome. I wouldn't mind meeting Roman and his wife. He's neat. Yeah, yeah. yeah especially Brittany. She's really cool. Yeah, I mm -hmm. think they would be really neat to just to meet. You Honestly, know? and probably what what we do, I guess, for social media and stuff, it would probably be better to get somebody. It's almost like riding dirt bikes. If you want to get faster, you got to ride with faster guys or whatever. It'd be cool to have people that are at that level. You know on social media right. and get some pointers from them and stuff you know because it can't hurt right so, absolutely i'd say something like that would be cool to meet a any of those people on that level you know that i mean the the roman really does seem i mean he's hyped up a little bit but it really does seem like it's i mean even when he went over his mom um passing away he seemed he seemed legit i you, you never know until you meet people in real life of how they act versus how they are on camera but the only other one i've i've heard some things about some other gun youtubers that um but i'm not i don't want to say any names or whatever but i've talked to scott on um dming from kentucky ballistics on instagram and he actually seems really cool so yeah he's genuinely a nice it seems like it, the, yeah. what we've always done is we normally you know are the people that we are on camera when we're not on ca on camera or whatever and some people like that and some people hate it but that's what i like about it or whatever it's just us i don't like being fake um which is probably why we got deleted. <laughs> uh, this is from Official Day Day. Can I please get gang banged by all of you? Um, probably not. Gang cause... banged. I couldn't do that. I've always thought about that on porn and stuff. I'm like, there's no way I could do that. I couldn't do that. I, I would not have a hard on with like two other guys in a room with a boner. <laughs> I wouldn't be able to do that. With my OCD, I'd have a heart attack. I couldn't do it. What What, what would be OCD about that? Something be out of place? One because your leaders, leaders just in there and then my leader was in there. Or something? I think he's talking about, like, gross. I don't <laughs> like, think, like, it would be... Like, if you're trying to bang her at the same time, two different guys, your nuts are touching together. Uh, see, wouldn't well, I get a, see, why'd you gotta read that one? That well, was sort of gross. Well, I mean, that might be the title of the video. The Bell Life wants to gangbang somebody. No, that's not what it says. Okay, can I please get gangbanged? I want to get gangbanged by the Bell Life. Go ahead. That's a horrible title. I don't have any sakes. <laughs> Only fans dropping soon? No. <laughs> no. No. Never Maybe know. keep an eye on 20 bucks is 20 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, this one is uh, P of... Which one do you look? This one or which one are you looking at? This one? <laughs> Boy's not gonna read it. <laughs> Says, what is the best life advice your mom gave you? I got that. I've, I've said that a hundred times. I know. Yeah, he, he's probably said it on here too. All right. I guarantee he has. Trey, go first. Well, she just said, if you don't want somebody doesn't want to be with you, why do you want to be with them? That's one of the best advice anybody's ever given me. And that was about a girl. <clears throat> so, and it made it just made sense and made me open my eyes. I'm like, exactly. Try not to waste nothing. What I would, what I would do from her. What she would say? Try not to waste something. Yeah. Oh, all well, the mayonnaise with her finger on it. Yeah. <laughs> Are you talking about grandma? Or are you talking about your mom? No, no. grandma no, would do that. Yeah. Well, we were on the boat. Uh -huh. I can remember the first boat trip. I I went out. Me and Justin were just dating, 
And that's how she put mayonnaise on my oh, sandwich. Your finger? Her finger licked it off, <laughs> which was fine. It didn't bother me at all. I mean, I didn't care. I was from, you yeah. know, we're from Kentucky, too. We yeah. don't care. That's so silly. She I said... She said when I was in school, I think that's why I, well, I mean, because I, you know, if you're, if you had a mom like our mom, we always tried to work her a little bit and tried to get to stay home from school, which is pretty easy to push over, but she never let us stay home from school, I'll tell you that. No, it was just Justin. When she got to the, but the thing that she said to me or whatever, um, it didn't make sense until I started working or whatever. She said, why don't you, and she said, instead of being sick at home, and it made sense when I started working, why don't you just be sick at work and make money? I thought, huh? that's the best advice she ever gave you. Well, I think it is because I always thought of that too when I would take off work. Remember, I take off work and be sitting here. I'm like, what in the world? Are we I could be making money at work than sitting here all day. I don't know. I don't know. I, I thought it was cool. Depends I, on how sick you I'm are. I'm gonna answer this too because yeah, I tell you one thing: the Corona thing that would have been hard. But I think that's the only thing that would ever shut that me. That was tough. Yeah. That would ever because I was exhausted, and that's mm -hmm. the only thing that would shut me down. I think. Uh, that, but that puke, I've never, puke and crapping thing. The puke and crapping, and crapping, I would not go out in public. Yeah. No, I'm saying that just makes it. That's yeah. normally like, even in. Yeah, if you if you got a first day of the puke and crapping bug, you can't. You gotta let. You no, gotta. Well, you can't leave. No, 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 no. Yeah, if that hits you at night, then it's, it's not even. It's not even about being able to muscle through it. It's just you. You just feel awful all day. You I'd have to have a bucket. It'd be a mess. I wouldn't want a bucket. Two packings of wipes. I just throw out the throw out the window. I know when I first, me, you know, me and Shari did the same work. She cleaned houses for years and years and years, and I cleaned houses for years. Even before I met Justin, I cleaned houses for five years in a different state. But um, we were talking one day, and she said, you know, I've always thought to myself, I don't ever want to put my name on anything that I can't be proud of. And that's always stuck with me. So anything I do, I try to be proud of it so that I can say that I did it. Yep. This one says, uh, from McKenzie, how much weight has Garen lost and would you guys do a workout vlog? I just said that. It wasn't yesterday. I said that yesterday. Oh, I am. Oh, I am. Uh. Oh, uh, uh. He goes, uh. <laughs> I just got to think about it. I actually get that paper. I just went and got scanned again. I could tell you how much muscle I've got. I don't know how much I've actually lost. Is it in your jacket here? No, it's in Adrian's car. I'm oh. in the car, see if she sent me a picture of it. But, uh, I was 237, and now I'm 202. Uh, so whatever that is. But, uh, but I was down below 200. I was 198. Wait, you started off 237? Mm-hmm. 35 pounds. But he was 237 fat. But oh, no. I thought you were like 250-something. No. Oh, Good my gosh. gosh. Oh, okay. Never mind. Ooh, that'd be rough. But now I'm back up above 200. So. But what's your... But what's your... Um... You were above 200 at 202, too. My, my index was at body percent fat. Yeah. Like, I'm 17% body fat right now at 202 pounds. So, so but, his body fat went way down and he's gaining muscle. Yeah, it was it was almost up to 30% body fat, <clears throat> which is awful. It's not good. <laughs> you bet the math on that? Like if you're 50%. If your body is 50% fat and then 50% well, plenty, of, plenty of pigs out there that don't look 50 like 50% fat and have no muscle. you imagine that? How weak are you? Um, How weak are you? He's such a clown. If I had to guess, I've probably lost 40, probably 40 pounds of fat, probably, I'd say. If I had to guess. Uh, oh, that's awesome, buddy. I've done skipped over a question and I can't find it. I'll go to the moment. Oh my gosh. What, uh... You didn't read it yet, just go to another one. It was something about 2024. Just go to another one, you didn't read it yet. Okay. Not tough. Any more videos gonna be on YouTube? Yes, Laura, on uh, Bell Life Bangs. Ask and the Bell and Life. this vlog video you're watching right now is on, what are you talking about? And Ask the Bell Life. They're talking about any of the website videos, like the oh. our comedy stuff. That's all on the website, thebelllife.com, but there's more slightly comedy stuff with guns on the Bell Life Bangs. With guns? Will you be designing a new hoodie? This is from Inks underscore Audi. 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 We we are hoping to have new designs out. We're trying to we're trying to go through all everything we got now, and everything's still on sale, right, Justin? Yeah. Everything's still fifty percent off. So go to the website and. Get I forgot some about merch. I forgot about that video. We need to do that. What video is that? Well, um. Well. This is he does it every time. How many tattoos is Trey gonna get this year? This year? Yeah. How many tattoos did you get last year? Of um, launch. Twenty-seven. Can't answer that. Honestly. Everything except for the 
the um yeah i don't know where i got the bell life tattoo and then the, on the other arm i got a lot i mean i don't know what how many i'm getting more i'm getting this year I mean, have we never done that with garen the balut egg did you not do the did you yeah, do with the duck egg. inside of it yeah. oh, okay oh you didn't watch oh gosh there's a duck in there <laughs> says uh that when is up. garen and adrian's wedding this is from morgan that's the title of the video. You know, I don't guess know what it game. is, but I can't remember what it is. Oh, oh my gosh. September. September 13th. No, 9th. It's close, but I think it's the 12th. 12th. Is it the 12th? Just give me the address, too. <laughs> no, I'm not giving No, it's not. It, it might be the... It's either... Shoot. It's either 11th. Nobody or, here knows what it is. 14th, maybe? I'll it's let you know Saturday. when I get an invitation to it. Well, I'll let you know. He's gonna, he'll let you know directly. We'll give you a full report. <laughs> it's in September sometime, right? Yeah, mid-September. This is from Smith. Smith. That's sad you don't know when your own wedding date is, guys. Did the fork in your butt hurt? Yes. It, it wasn't hurt. exactly in the butt hole. It was it just was, a crack. It was it in the sucked. cheeks. It sucked bad. That's that taser the, thing, everything about that thing sucks. That's on thebelllife.com. Yeah, it's not fun. That's crap, it's just miserable. Oh, here's, here's, now this is a better, this is a more... Hey, Bell Life, if you can make a video with any celebrity, who would you pick? That would have been better. The last one was supposed to be focused towards social media. What? Celebrity, who would I pick? Well, social media well, is they have celebrities, too. I, still pick the same I guess they are celebrities, yeah. Yeah, I mean... This is from Nick. Are you related? <laughs> yes. We're gonna, you're going to get crickets, Nick, on that. <laughs> you ain't been watching very long, bud. Are you related? <laughs> oh, man. Here we go. This is Eric. Uh, would you accept 5 million YouTube subscribers, but no sex for a whole year? Oh, <coughs> man. <laughs> with, along with, the, along with the, the views and stuff, 5 million subscribers with two views or 5 million subscribers and with a good average amount of views. If it's a good average amount of views, I mean, might have to take one for the team. That's not taking one for the you team. You can have subscribers, but you can have something to put out. You know what I'm saying? What? You can have videos to put out. Oh yeah, well we have that. That's what we're getting. That's what we're working towards. Is the subscribers part. <laughs> that's what we're working towards. We got two videos. It just takes a long time. Just we've been working at it for a long time. You guys should do a YouTube live one day from waking up to going to bed. That would be God. a boring day, Johnny. Oh my gosh, you wouldn't even be awake when I got up. <laughs> what time do you get up, Gary? Back to four in the morning. You're back. Oh, are you up at four? Mm -hmm. Why are you up at four? He's he was. We, so we, I get done and get back up there and get to get to get after it. Oh, he's probably doing. Were you squatting this morning at four? No, this morning. Back, You're doing. His back. No, everything's different now. I don't even know what we did today. Back did you go in, in the morning? Back in bonds, yeah. You all went this morning already? Mm -hmm. And yesterday morning. Little Michael was asleep. I think he walked in, showered, <clears throat> ate, and then went right to sleep. Last night. Yeah, he was beat. I, is, I can't take that. Creatine and pre workout stuff at night, either. I'm, I'm, I was literally up all night long. I wasn't going to sleep till like four in the morning. What time did you go? What time did you go to work today? What time did I get? Huh? Yeah. Okay. Creatine keeps you up? Uh, left. I wonder if that's going on with me. Left, uh, I got there at 7 15 this morning. Did you really? You left the house before seven? No, I was at Ford Air at 7 15. I left your house at five. Oh, you drove the truck at five? Yeah. Oh, because you went to the gym. Yeah. Would you rather have a private chef all year or a private jet three times a year? Both chef, are free. Chef all year, hands down. I would do a chef. Yeah, yeah I don't know why. What'd would... you just say? Justin would do a chef too. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the. Yeah, would you rather have a private chef all year or a private jet three times a year? Both are free. Mm, I'm going with the jet. Chef. I'm going with the jet. How much what? is Garen benching these days? Looking good, brother. Garen, Thank if you, you had a private chef all year, all you'd have to do is let them cook you healthy a, food. I already have a private chef, Amy. I know. So does Justin, <laughs> and that's why I'm advocating for Adrian. I don't, wow. I don't, I don't Garen, how much you benching? I don't, I don't have an answer to that. The most are wrapped on the bench is 250 Oh, full of crap. I want to see that. All right, we'll go over there right after that. You can rep 250. Yes. No way. I just did it in front of Michael. I've repped it three times. I don't think Michael. I can rep 250. No way. <laughs> you mean 150. If I'm only doing 150, I'm quitting. You're repping 250. Yes, Justin. 
we might have to see if y'all will let us know if you want to see a video on that. <laughs> see, see a video. That could be the title of this video, Garen from the Bell Life Reps 250 now. Sam Sulek might see it. People ask me that all the time. What, what do you bench press? I couldn't tell you what I bench press you put. I don't go out and do PRs and all this nonsense. I did 315 once. I didn't do that. No, I, that was at Florence Gym in between buys and tries. Are we going back to what we did when we were in our, in our 20s? Was that my you know 20? what I mean? Was that in my 20s then? I don't know. I don't know. That's what I'm saying. I mean, what yeah, are you going back to? Uh, <clears throat> here you go. Are you guys fans of the UFC? Yeah. I like the UFC. I don't know what that is. Ultimate Fighting Challenge. Oh. No. I don't watch I, it. I, I, was it really Challenge? I didn't know that. I like um, it. I don't know. I don't, I, don't really, I don't really get in. I'm not against it, but I'm just not into it. Same I like here. it. Same here. I mean, I like. I would watch motocross, supercross any longer. Dana but, White's kind of like me. He's in your face. He's, he's got his name's Dana though. Okay. You know what I mean? Like to have his money. I don't know, but what about his name? What if your name was Dana? And I had his money? No, uh, Dana. You didn't have his money. Well, Justin, I mean, that's your name, I guess. Yeah. My name's Trey. What if his name was Trey? A lot of people. No, there's not a lot of Trey's. What is your dream gun? Dream gun? Yeah. Huh. Dream gun. I like one of them SP5 full autos. MP5, yeah. Was that MP5? HK MP5. Oh, my S mine's SP5. Pre-1986 transferable. Yeah, yeah, right. That's transferable. That would be cool. That full but, I mean, yeah, that would be my dream gun, but a really cool one to have, which I don't think you can own, is a, uh, a mini gun would be really sweet. Those are neat. Be about, like a, I think it's like a thousand dollars of every five seconds. Yeah, it's more expensive. Oh my god! I guess it'd be that H and K too, whatever you guys just said. Yeah, I think it's sweet. MP5. They're sixty thousand dollars. How much are they? Sixty thousand. And up there, Black Rose, he's got one that's gold plated, but it's a semi-automatic. But you, if you get to, if you could get one that's gold plated, that's back pre '86, <laughs> what that thing be worth? You right. Hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> The MP5, that's that's uh, that's the selector goes uh, safe, um, three round burst. No, safe, sem um, semi-automatic, three round burst, then full auto. That's the that's the sweet one. Sorry, I called it backwards. Oh, here we go, Trey. You thinking of marriage now? That could be the title too. Am I thinking that's of a big marriage? Topic, right? That's a hot topic right now. Mm. Everybody's wanting to know. Everybody. Everybody. Inquiring minds are wanting to know. Justin, I don't. I mean, you know. He says his famous quote is, never say never. Yeah. You know, I never say never. That's the truth. Well, I think if you didn't think she was worth marrying, you probably still wouldn't be in the relationship, would you? Well, I mean, she's definitely worth marrying. I mean, there's probably no doubt about it. she's worth right. marrying. Right. You know what I mean? Because if she wasn't, then you'd be exiting the premises. You'd be done. Yeah. If she was a piece of trash. No, I mean, I, I definitely, you know, we've, talked, we've talked about things. I'm not going to sit here and say what's going to happen next year or this year or whenever, you know, and I don't know what, yeah, yeah. You, know, you never know, but mm -hmm. what is it? yeah, we've talked about it. This is from Cassie. What is the weirdest thing someone has done in your home or to you, if anything? What? The Amy weirdest. licking my butt. That would be the weirdest thing. I mean, that's, so that's true. It's weird. What do you mean? I, that's my weirdest thing. The weirdest thing anybody's ever done to me? There's a lot of weird stuff that's been done in this house before by other We're people. We're not talking sex. Oh. Let's oh. just leave No, I mean, down. I'm saying with pooping and peeing, uh, who's ever peed in their kitchen before in a Tupperware container? You know I don't even want to talk about it. That's what I'm saying. Justin, that stuff, that, that's not what, I don't think that's where the question was going. No, that's so, definitely you, not where it was going. What's the weirdest thing someone has done in your home? Someone. Or, yeah, or to your house, or to you. If anything, the weirdest thing. <laughs> oh, Garen's got some pretty weird stuff. They always put, they always put you right on that one. This one? Yeah. Don't don't read another one until you answer that one. Okay. I already did. Oh. I okay. did. I was the first one to answer. Okay. Well, nobody else got to answer it. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. I really don't even know what to say. I don't even have a home. Nobody's really ever done anything to me weird. You know what I mean? I mean, like, um, that I that I can recall. Maybe. I've been hitting the head with a beer bottle. In your home? No. Outside. <laughs> oh my god, I'm pressed. You can't even get out of it. I've had a beer bottle busted over my head. No. <laughs> had that happen. Um, and we had some family friends come over and they got into me and Katie's stuff and started playing with it and tore all kinds of stuff. I mean, it's not really the weirdest 
That's the most aggravating thing that's ever happened. <laughs> I don't really know of anything that's happened. I just don't have any. I, tell you, I still say this is a weird thing that's oh, happened. Oh, I know exactly what you're going to say. The, the sweeper. The dent in the wall. No, no, oh, no. The sweeper. Was, the sweeper. Huh? Well, that was mom's. That the was sweeper. mom's weirdest thing. Mine was, mine was the Christmas ornaments showing up at my house. And we still to this day don't know where the Christmas ornaments came from that are on my tree. And they all say Michaela. And it's got Michaela's name and age. And, and they're. The they're Michaela bagger. from Garen? I have no idea where it came from. Where? It went to Nobody. Your house? Carly doesn't know. No, nobody knows. Where's my phone? I'll call her right now. <laughs> I'll call her on things. I, that, that her name's kind of, Michaela? Yeah, the, that's Michaela from the videos. From Ask the Bell Life. Nah, that's not her, but listen, watch this. See if she answers first. She probably won't answer. We're going to do all this. She probably won't answer after She never does. Right. Right. Well, she could be asleep. She's not asleep. What time is it? Hello? Hey. Yeah? Where did the Christmas ornaments, Michaela Christmas ornaments, come from? Dad, we already have tried to figure this out. <laughs> Nobody knows. <laughs> there you go. All right, love you, babe. Love you. Why? Because we got a question on uh, Ask the Bell Life about that. Or not Ask the Bell Life. This is the blog. So somebody asked and said the weirdest thing that's ever happened. I said, we got Christmas ornaments that showed up yeah, at our house. that is the weirdest thing. And nobody knows where really they came from. Weird. So, we right. asked, we've asked everybody. Nobody knows. All, All right. right. Love you. Love you, too, bye. Bye. There you go. Okay. We still got them. We still put them on the tree. Why? Just because they're what It says Michaela all over it? It's a, yeah, it's got her name and the year of it and everything. I wonder, I wonder if they got cameras in them. I have no idea. That <laughs> they only turn on at Christmas. I've asked Brantley where they came from. I've asked, you know, I ask everybody. Nobody has a clue. So, says, Brantley? What do you he, mean? He doesn't even know what, which way is up at the time. <laughs> in your all's opinion, would you rather conceal carry uh, Glock 43? Oh, a Glock 43? Or two, a high point. A Glock, Glock 43. 43. I shouldn't even answer. Who's cutting what? Somebody. Somebody. <laughs> uh, Just this 32 minutes here, bud. Yeah. How long are you going to drag this on? Well, we're, on, we're at the end here. Huh? We're at the end. Go Question. On. Would you all rather have half y'all's height or twice y'all's weight? Ooh. I'm Man, going, I'm going with twice the weight because I can. I, I, if twice your weight right now. Oh, no, 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 you'd be back. 500 pounds. I want to be short. Be or you want to be you want to be you half be, your height, so you'd be three feet tall. I think you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this day and age, no, that could I'll do work 500 pounds and I'll lose weight. That could <laughs> not be a three feet tall. I guess it's all you. Yeah, that's the only yeah. option. There's yeah. only option to that. You want to be three feet tall? Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Golly, Gary, be a foot and a half. <laughs> be a foot and a half. That means I'm only three feet now. <laughs> If you're four, what are you, five something? What are you going to be, two and a half feet tall? Five, five, eight, eight and a half, half or something. Right? Or something. Two and a half feet tall. 24, 27, you know, whatever that is. Almost 30 inches tall. That's that pitiful. That would be cool, though. No, no, it wouldn't be cool for me. It wouldn't be cool for him, but it'd be cool for us. We could have a, we could have a, uh, what do you say, Justin? Uh, a little person. We could have a big YouTube channel. What? I mean, it'd, 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 it'd be if literal. you were 500 pounds and I was three feet tall, that would be the most viral YouTube channel ever. <laughs> Kidding me? We'd have a TLC show. TLC. Show. <laughs> One brother's 500 pounds. Other one's three foot tall. 100 pounds. <laughs> well, I'm going with the friggin' 500 pounds. Is what I'm going with, hands down. Could you imagine having to lose that? No, it would suck. Now? It would suck. And here's the last. But question. I can't imagine being three feet tall either. That, yeah, that'd be hard. Here's the last question: Are you boys circumcised? Yep. Yep. I don't. Yes, I am. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm fighting my parents right now in court for doing that to me. <laughs> I think it's so. I think it's so weird. I've only ever seen one in real life, an uncircumcised wiener. It's the weirdest looking thing I've ever seen in the world. Nasty. Couldn't imagine that. You know the goo you get from banging. You imagine that goo up inside all Justin. around there. It was disgusting. disgusting. Yeah, well, you get a disease from it. Gary's just in. I just think it's gross. I never understood it. First one I saw was at Taylor Mill Elementary peeing at the trough. That's when I saw it. All right, land Oh on. gosh. But I don't, really look at, I don't look at other guys at the trough. I said, what in the <laughs> world? <laughs> the what in the world is that? Like a oh, freaking, like he a worm. turn around and hit well, you in the face with it. Well, you're only a kid, it sounds like. You were only a kid, right? Yeah, I don't know. Teacher, And I always tried to, I always, I always tried to go to the being. stall. I always tried to go to the stall. Oh, yeah, I do now, yeah. It was another kid? Yeah. 
There wasn't some Why was I looking at a teacher's wiener? Yeah, I don't stall. know. I the only people Why are know. you looking at anybody's wiener? <laughs> well, it looked weird. That's what I want to do. You I have know. to physically look down yeah. at somebody's wiener to No, stand when it's one of them troughs, you know how it is. You gotta you have to the whole time have to look straight down in order That's not to That's why they put magazines up on the wall and stuff to look at. And uh, yeah, you gotta you got a serious what? if you break concentration. Look at? In some bathrooms they have like <laughs> like down in the adrenaline cycles, they got all the new year side by sides up there on the wall. Oh yeah. That's just an example. It's just a it's a That's sales. just an example. I'll use that as an example. It's a they sales don't put anything on the stall wall for us to look at. It's a sales pitch. Anyways, yeah, if you go to a gas station right now, it's nothing. Oh, I thought this was like a bill mill for a second. It's not a bill mill. Thanks for all the questions. Um, that feels like acid in my life. Uh, we'll do these every once in a while if you guys like the Q and A's or not or whatever. But um, I saw a couple other questions in there about doing uh, story times about the jail and all that kind of stuff and um, day in the lives and all that. Just leave a comment down below what you all want. To, what you all would want to see on the wall channel. We'll go from there. Subscribe here. Subscribe to the Bell Life Bang. Subscribe to S the Bell Life and then check us out on thebelllife.com. Thanks. Have a great day.